Well, tonight, another central Pennsylvania school district is discussing gender identity in its policy. Thanks for joining us for Fox 43 News at 10. I'm Evan Forrester. And I'm Amy Lutz. The district's current policy does not specify whether students can play sports based on the gender they identify with. Fox 43's Logan Perrone explains what moves the school board is and is not taking. New Year, same discussion. Conestoga Valley School District joined the growing list of schools, considering a review or change with regards to gender in its sports policy. A number of suggestions as what we should do or what we could do. At some point, we have to decide what we're going to do next. No official vote was taken, though an informal poll answered two issues. First is context to the athletic policy. I would like to change the policy to specify biological boys and girls sports. Biological Boys play on boys sports, biological girls. School board decided eight to one with one absence to not change the policy to specify which genders can participate in which sports. No, I do not. At this point, I can't support that change being recommended. Board President Ida Groft marked legal trouble and what is best for the students as the reason for the poll. The board did unanimously decide to change the language on who handles these issues, removing it from the principal's hands and placing it in the hands of the superintendent. Advocates in attendance say they need to have the students in mind. I think that they need to pay attention to Pennsylvania law. And as Mrs. Groff said, they also need to pay attention to what is best for the students what is most equitable. While today's poll is a clear step forward, the debate is far from over. As things change, it will come before this board again. School district officials say there's no concrete timeline for any changes to the athletic policy. However, it will be on a future agenda. Reporting in East Lambert Township, Lancaster County, Logan Perrone, Fox 43 News.